If you ask any of the Peters family, they would say Lance is interested in just about any piece of machinery. But headers are still one machine which hold a special appeal to him. This John Deere 95 header was purchased on the 26th of June 1966 by Lance's great uncle, Eric Peters, to replace his Oliver 35. At the time of the purchase, a comment was made by Eric in regards to never needing a header any bigger than this. But as most of us know, there is always a need for a larger piece of equipment and the header was eventually sold off. It was later through a conversation regarding the clearing sale that the 95 was mentioned and wanted to bring it back home to his collection, Lance was able to buy it again. It had been stored in a shed and not used for almost 35 years, leaving it in great condition for its age. Many headers at the time were converted to a Perkins diesel, but this header still runs its original John Deere petrol 217 cubic inch six cylinder engine rated at 87 brake horsepower at 2500 RPM through a four speed transmission with a variable speed belt drive. It has a 19 foot front with a six bat feed reel. And while the grain tank was originally of 80 bushel weight, extensions that were added gave the tank a weight of approximately two and a half ton of wheat or 92 and a half bushels. In 2009, the Peters family purchased a John Deere 9770, which is still in use as the current farm header.